Hey YouTube, how's it going? It's your boy, Marf's Customs, aka Marf Man. So today, we're gonna take a break from the Civic build and we're gonna go back to my Daji, the big ram. I think the last video I did was um, the transformation one, which I'll put here if you guys wanna check it out. Three parts today, should all be pretty simple. Um, so the first one, it was all 120 US, that's what it all was. So first one, you guys see that? LED headlights. I'm not sure if they will work. Now they're for my truck, but I just don't know if they're gonna be like capable. I know LEDs are a bit different than regular bulbs. Moving on to the next one, just a gas cap cover from Bully. Um, I thought it looked good because I have those fender flares. I think that would look good and go with those. Now let's unbox this boy. Figure out get this guy up. So we open the box, we got our instructions. We'll probably need those and no clean them. Bunch of stuff. So oh yeah, here's our hardware. Look at that. Here is the roof rack in all its freaking glory. Million parts. Like what? So we got the box shape coming. So the instructions are kind of confusing but kind of simple at the same time. So this you start, there's only one or two that look like that. It's all here. Not too hard. This is a complete separate piece once you just start. So it has nothing to do with this first part. You do that piece, that's the front, it's the easiest part. And then you just combine it all and now you should have the, the box. I think it looks pretty cool so far. Um, I wanted it for my spare, hoping it'll fit. All right guys, so now you just pour through there, it just has that extra support. And now I'm gonna move on. I think we're gonna start doing like the weave pattern. But yeah, pretty simple so far. It's a 10 mil for the nuts. And then it comes with an Allen key. Okay guys, I don't understand this, so. <laughs> There's only two spots to put these. Why it doesn't line up? Why? I, I've checked everything I could think of. I thought since it was so cheap, maybe a mistake like that was possible, but it was me. <laughs> so the sides were on the wrong side, so I just flipped it around and everything lined up. So if you guys have that issue, you know how to do it now, just flip the sides. Literally unbolt this side over there, pull it back, and then flip it around and you'll be good. So before I finish the roof rack, I'm going to go ahead and do this cover here. I wanted to get some sort of accomplishment because I have work today. So I don't think I'm gonna be able to complete the roof rack before I go to work. So I'm gonna get this guy ready to put on. All right guys, there's one mud. A little bit uh, cleaner than the fender flares, but when it gets dirty, it'll look alike. And I think that looks pretty cool. Something really small, but it can just give it that little pop. I normally don't like doing the gas cover things. Like a lot of people do it, but I think it's cool. It's got the same bolts, same type of style, so. I think that looks pretty good. Roof rack's ready. Um, I'm gonna keep going on the roof rack now. <laughs> Another huge mistake uh, is all these. I don't know why, but I didn't. I just thought these were for something else. These go under those bars. The other things we need so we can bolt this on. BRB and a freaking gainer, man. I hate this shit. All right, guys, don't make those mistakes because they're annoying. I don't know if like, this, I mean, it's a hundred percent the saying you get what you pay for. Pretty nice though. Should be nice and sturdy. It feels pretty good. Uh, so it's fully done now. No mistakes left to make. Now I, the roof rack is done, but I just got to figure this out. Thing. All right guys. So that the rack part doesn't fit the truck. It's too short. Absolute joke but it is what it is. We're gonna leave this for another day, another video. Okay guys, let's do these LED headlights. We just gotta pop this cover off. Okay, step one, done. Now, take our grill out, four bolts. 
And then we should be, have access to our headlights. As easy as that. So they do work. I don't, I have to check everything though. I just turned it on. They do work. But see how there's a gap there? When you push it in, it doesn't actually clip. So I'm going to try to see what I can do about that. And I'll let you guys know. All right, guys. So two zap straps going across and then one at the top holding it together. Trust me, it looks like I don't know what I'm doing, <laughs> but it's that's facts, it'll work, proven. Okay, so just throw it all back together and you're done. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. It was a bit of a weird one. Roof rack doesn't fit, it's really unfortunate. I'm choked. It was my bad though, it says it doesn't fit. I, would I was drunk, you know, I was already when I ordered it, but we won't talk about that. <laughs> Yeah, this is all done. Everything works normal, high beams, low beams. I'll leave the link to everything, like I said before. And it looks awesome with the white. I'll show you guys quickly. But yeah, so we got, so in this vid, we did that. We did these lights. Super bright, like crazy. And then the roof rack didn't fit, but I showed you how to build it kind of, <laughs> but it is what it is. Maybe you can throw it on the sieve. I'm probably just going to sell it. Maybe get a new one. But I don't know what will fit in the truck. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a thumbs up. Comment for the Dodgy. We need to see more of the Dodgy on here. Dawson's Jeep never comes on the channel anymore. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe over there. Hit that bell. Subscribe bell button. Let's catch you guys in the next one. Peace.